Continuing the series on surviving Android, one of the applications that I do have installed, one of the few applications I have installed, is NewPipe. NewPipe is a great application for watching YouTube videos. Not only does it, is it free and open source, it allows you to watch your YouTube videos ad-free on your Android device. It allows you to download your YouTube videos. It also allows you to start the audio and turn off the screen and allow it to continue playing. NewPipe, although is a great application, you will not find it in the Google Play Store because it violates YouTube's service agreement, I believe is the reason it's not there. But it is in F-Droid, so you can either install the F-Droid application and install it that way, or just go to F-Droid, uh, the F-Droid website, search for a new pipe and install it, although you won't automatically get updates, which is very important for a program like this. If you've ever used applications like YouTube DL, you know that they work great, but every once in a while, there'll be a day where all of a sudden it doesn't work anymore, and then a day or two later, you, you get the update that, does it, that fixes things, because YouTube is constantly changing the way their website works so that they don't want you downloading the videos. So they make changes, and it takes a little while for these applications to catch up, but they're usually pretty quick. And that's probably one of the biggest drawbacks of this, and it happened to me a week or two ago. I come in here, I go to watch a video, and it just gave me a whole bunch of errors. Um, a day or two later, I got an update, and it was working again. But YouTube DL, very easy, easy to use, GUI interface. If you want to watch YouTube videos, download the YouTube videos for offline play. It lets you pick uh, you know, the resolution, lets you pick whether you want to download uh, the video or the audio, lets you set how many threads uh, it uses downloads, so more threads, the faster it will download, um, although it's also more taxing on the system. And of course, let me just click on one of my videos here. It's going to open it up. There's a share button. There's a pop out, so you can have a pop out video. You have a download. You can add it to a playlist. And then there's a, a uh, let's see, focus right there. You can kind of see it. There's a headphone button right there. You press that. It just plays audio instead of video. And then you can turn off your screen, which is something that uh, you know you need to have like YouTube Red, Red or something special normally to do on YouTube, but you can do it right here with a free and open source application. So again, that is NewPipe is the name of the application. You'll find it in the F-Droid repositories. Check it out. It is very useful. Um, I'm trying to think if there's any other features. Uh, history. Oh, you, if, you, if you want, if for some reason you want to open it in the browser, there's a button that says open in browser up here so you can watch it or for some reason go to it in the web browser. Um, basically, it's kind of like a, a GUI interface for uh, YouTube DL, which is an awesome application that I use on my desktop and actually I use on my phone too and we'll talk about in a future video. But check it out. Thanks for watching. Visit my website, filmsbychris.com. That's Chris the K. There's a link in the description. If you're enjoying my videos, be sure to like, share, subscribe, and if you can support, patreon.com forward slash mylux1000. Also a link in the description below. Check out my website. There you can search through all my videos. There's support links there, also for PayPal and the Patreon. And you can also look through my codes there under the software section. I thank you for watching, and as always, I hope that you have a great day.